We're here with Manos Kalisis versus Petru Athanasiu from Kritikos Camp. Round one. I'm here with my main man, David. Hey, how you doing? You enjoying it tonight? Tonight's been a great night of fights already. Seen some good knockouts, a lot of good back and forth action. Yeah, this should be explosive. I think we've, uh, I know a lot about Kin uh, Kalisis. Yeah, we, we commented on his last fight. We called him Mini Mike because he had <laughs> that same style. Yeah, he's tough. Very strong, Ooh, but very his opponent nice tonight combination. is coming strong. Very nice combination. Very fluid with his hands and his feet. Oh, nice combo by Mike Bass. We're in a derby right from the first round. Yeah, three threes is always full on flat out action. Matched at 61 kilos, these two. Both the so shorter, stockier type of fighter. Those always get for like more exciting type matches. A lot of more of core on core action. Big on the street. Yeah, he sort of muscled him over there. It wasn't really a knockdown, so no count there from the referee. The action will be kept moving. Nice kick from Manolis. He's trying to use the knees and the switch, the switch knee and the low kick. Maybe it's something his uh, corner had seen in video. Yeah, very similar style, both these guys. Very explosive, strong. I see a lot of taping around the... Uh, Ankles of Petros, is that something that you see a lot of here? I see it quite a bit in Greece actually, it's, it's quite strange. It's almost like they have uh, shin pads on when they have that much shape here. Yeah, I think it would be a disadvantage for me. I, I think you're stopping the shin there. That was a solid kick. That left body kick from Manolis. Manolis is just coming forward with kicks. Now that... Oh, none of those punches really landed, but that low kick landed. Flush by Manolis. He's keeping a really high guard. Ooh. Both guys are so explosive. It seems always in a minute there could be any minute there could be trouble. It's crazy to think this is just round one. Yeah. Oh. Good shot. I don't know if that rocked him or he was off his base. He's going in for the kill there. Oh. oh nice switch kick. But it gets more on the hands, and my name is going straight back to chopping down the tree. He's got a solid left body kick on him, Manolas. I think that leg might be damaged a bit, because he's starting to kind of slow down. But, oh, no, he's coming right back. It's a very evenly matched up fight. Yeah, great matchup. Great pro promotion here by... Pablos Caponis, of course, and, and the MTGP in Greece. Another big low kick, inside, outside, just trying to tear up that front leg. Massive hooks being thrown by both men here. Very nice. Round two. Yeah, a lot slower start now. Well, you know, when they burn off that initial adrenaline dump, and now they're kind of calming down, getting into a rhythm. So solid with those shots, though. Oh, that left body kick is a stinger. Yeah, that's going to hurt tomorrow. Ooh. Ooh, caught clean there. Hard. He's caught. He's caught. Yeah. Manolis needs to keep his hands up. Yeah, right now, he can't enter the brawl. He is hurt. Petro's there, just keeping his man off balance, and did really well coming forward kept Manolis off balance and kept peppering him with shots. Yeah, he really furiously coming forward, lots of volume, and he knew he had his opponent a bit days and he tried to take advantage of it. Yeah, Is Manolis. He? Manolis did really well to ride that and come back. They almost the mirror image of each other when they fight, aren't they? Yeah, it's, it's, it's quite eerily similar. I think that left leg of Petro's is, is damaged now. If Manolis keeps chopping that leg, I don't know how long he'll stand on it. I, I really think that that was a game plan from the beginning because he's been working on it non-stop. I don't know why he stopped though. Yeah, it, it, maybe, maybe he's just trying to clear the cobwebs. There you go. Uh, he's going right back to it now. Back to work. His opponent seems to be a little, give a little less volume. Oh, that kick is beautiful. Yeah, look, that left leg's going. Manolis needs to keep chopping the lead leg, and I think he could finish this fight early. There oh. you go. And now Pedros is finding it hard to block. It means he's in a world of pain in there. 
At this point, my nervous isn't blocking either, but I don't think that Petrus has his stick oh. on his kick anymore. Oh, man. That, I can feel that pain. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, man. I'm feeling the pain from the mark. Oh, nice right hand, right on the chin, though. As he eats a straight points right down the middle. My Come nervous, my nervous has to be careful. This guy is not out of the fight. Yeah. Oh, big man. Oh, hey, oh, jumping knee. Chop the leg, Manolis. Oh, nice leg kick again. Oh. I don't think it's a good idea for Manolis to sit in the corner. Right? No, he needs to come out, not against someone so powerful, but look at that leg. Yeah, his leg is definitely, definitely damaged. Oh. Athanaseu is one tough guy though. He has taken so many shots on that lead left and leg. He, and he throws the kicks with his, with his back leg. I don't know how he's even standing on it with all the kicks. Oh, oh that man. Brutal. Surely Manolas can sense the pain that is going through the man in the blue corner's head. Look at that leg. He can't even block anymore. Oh my. Final round. Here we go for the third and final round with these two absolute warriors here, matched at 61 kilos on KGP2, here live in Athens, Greece. And my notice is right back on the kicks, right to the body, right to the outside leg. Same strategy since the first round. Oh! Again with the acrobatic jump in knees, but if he could just chop that leg, I feel he could stop him. Yeah, I don't know if, oh. Oh, as he's a big right hand again. It's been such a powerful shot for uh, Anatheseu. I'm shocked he's able to generate power off of those legs. He's been so damaged, especially his front leg. True. Oh, that left kick again is so lightning fast. You know it hurt when we both go yeah. ooh at the same time. <laughs> oh. Those are big shots. Oh, nice combo back. But my notice is really starting to get the rhythm of this fight now. Yeah, I think, like, as you say, I think it was it was a tight fight there for a bit. That leg kicking was really dominant, but, oh, and he pulls out the bag. I think I saw him practicing that on Instagram the other day. Yeah, he, he actually comes originally from a Kyushin karate background and then changed the kickboxing. So, went back to his roots. Yeah, there you go, back to the leg. Look, it's almost gone. That leg is bruising up badly. If he just chops that leg, he can stop the fight. I think if he adds some punches beforehand and then goes to the leg, we'll have clear shots. His opponent obviously can't check anymore. Yeah, as you say, sometimes it's the simple stuff that wins fights more often than not. Yeah. You know, you're young, get a little excited. <laughs> big stage on the show. Oh. oh, that was a big shot. Man, I'm feeling that pain in the leg. His opponent is still in the fight. I can't believe it. That right hand though from uh, Petros is really landing every time. Yeah, you know, if he, if he tried to throw that more often in the fight more early on, he might have had a bigger success in the later round. But he waited until his leg was a bit too chopped up in my opinion. Somebody just letting off an air horn there in here. I thought it was the end of the round, but... Me too, he co I got a bit confused. Yeah. Oh, oh look, yeah. the leg's going. He's going. It's almost Manolas over. can see it, look. He can't even block anymore, his leg hurts so much. Oh man, I feel this guy's pain. Oh, Let the right hand right run. Oh. Manolas has to be careful. Oh. He can't come in reckless. Last, last 10 seconds of this exciting K1 boat. This is going for the kill here. Oh, big shot. Wow. What a fight. What a fight. Okay. After three hard fought rounds, we have a decision. The winner in the red corner, Manoles Kalistis.